Hey, what's up everybody? Welcome to the Badminton Serve, where we serve you. On this channel, I talk about product reviews, I give exclusive drops on products coming out, interviews, and cover a lot more other badminton topics. If this is of interest to you, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel to grow the Badminton Serve family. Like my videos as it helps with the algorithm, and don't forget to hit that bell notification because every time I release a new video, you will be automatically notified. With that being said, let's get straight into it. What's up everybody? Okay, in this video, I'm gonna be talking about the new Yonex Mavis Field Due 2 E uh, Yi. Uh, yeah, okay, Mavis Field 2. Let's check it out. Okay, everybody, here it is. The new Yonex Mavis Field 2 nylon shuttlecock. Okay, so on first looks at this shuttle, it looks like I just purchased some mortars from World War One, You know, but upon opening it, and if I can, it tells a very different story, right? Very interesting design. The back part of the nylon shuttle obviously looks the same as, as most of the other Mavises, but the tip part is what's interesting to me. The honeycomb tip, they call it. Okay, the honeycomb tip. It's Yonex's newly designed tip construction, which reduces air resistance by allowing it to pass directly through from the front to the back. Combined with the increased tip weight, the flight stability is actually improved by 30%. The combination of a soft material and honeycomb structure also ensures a 50% reduction in impact shock. Right, once hit. I actually tested this shuttle last week during a social at indoors. It flies very, very quick, right? It actually makes some people look better than what they actually are. But in all seriousness, it's for outdoor use. But, but I wanted to test it regardless. I understand why it's designed for outdoors with the heavier tip and the new honeycomb design. It can fly through the air and, you know, with elements such as wind with ease. My take on this product, definitely for outdoor use. The shuttle color is definitely a sight to see, but I'm not too sure about the black honeycomb tip color if it's used outdoors. You know, uh, is, is it gonna be clear enough? Uh, or should they have gone with a brighter color? Hey, you know, some people might like the black and some might not. So I guess it comes down to the player. If compared to the other Mava shuttles, I would say that it would be about a 9 out of 10 with a newly designed tip for better performance. Thank you all so much for tuning into this video. I hope you enjoyed it as much as I enjoyed making it. Please stay safe, take care, and I'll see you all in my next video.